I want to spend some time showing you how to navigate our Canvas course so that you can complete the course content from the textbook or our, our online homework, the written homework. And so the best way you're going to do that is starting with module one. You will see we have an introduction. I talked about these um, assignments need to be completed by these due dates here. And these are the orientation material. But once we get started with the textbook, chapter one, for example, data collection, what you're going to do is first you're going to want to download the note sheets. Those are my um, outline sheets. You're going to want to download them, or more than likely print them out, or you can handwrite this material. But when you print them out, you will see um, these note sheets would come out. And they're kind of fill in the blank sheets with examples. And so how you're going to fill them out. So these are our note sheets. How are you going to fill those note sheets out? I have them for every section of the book. How you're going to fill them out is with the video. So you can see at the beginning of a chapter, you see I have note sheets and then I have video lectures that go with those note sheets. And so that's me talking through the note sheets. So when you hit play here, Exactly. You will see me talking through doing like a class lecture here, but when and I'm using a PowerPoint to kind of guide you through that and talk you through some of that material that you're then documenting. So you can see that's how like a class lecture. You could also read the textbook, and you can see me filling out that. So that's the first way that you're going to go ahead and. Uh, start to learn in the class is by using the videos to fill in these note sheets. Once those videos are then uh, viewed and you complete the note sheets, you then have um, the online homework that goes with uh, with the textbook. And so once you click that, you will get the um, assignments to come up as soon as you've logged in um, to the course with that. I haven't started this, so this is what's going to happen. You're going to be asked to uh, to begin a course, and you'll accept that once you click on that. You can also get started and register with your code or with the um, with the um, if you have an account, use it, or you're going to create a new account um, or sign in with an old one. You can also do that here at My Lab Master to do that before we get started. But that's where you'll complete your online homework. In addition to online homework, as it's outlined in the syllabus, I have uh, written homework problems. Those are going to be collected at the end of the, uh, and the, during the final, but you're still responsible for doing them. I have those here. Those are the problems from the textbook, the section, and then the problems from those section. And then either you're going to have the physical copy of the book or you'll have the e-copy because that's you're only purchasing the e-version. And so then I also have written solutions to each of those textbook problems so you can see um, so that you can check your work. I've already posted videos for the written solutions. So that's how you're going to navigate note sheets, videos, take notes from the videos, read your textbook to complete your note sheets, and then you have written and online homework problems. So that's going to be the basic way. And then we have a discussion post um, that follows each chapter. And um, these discussion posts are where you're going to post questions. There's four tasks that you want to read through. Um, there are, are um, again, you're either going to post a question from your online homework, post a question from the written homework. Again, make sure you're following along with that. Um, or you're going to reply to somebody, or you're going to uh, answer one of these tasks. You have to do one of those tasks. And so that happens at the at once um, we do that once for every kind of chapter or, or groups of problems and those are the discussion boards so that's how we kind of navigate through it once in a while um, and it's listed in the course calendar we have additional assignments statistical questions is due 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 june 21st so that's an additional assignment um, you had these other posts here but that's the kind of general way that you're going to go through the the material note sheets videos and then complete your assignments. You'll see there are some more, um, some other assignments here, uh, Canvas assignments that I have here that you will complete that have due dates also in addition to the online and written textbook and discussion boards. 
So make sure you're mindful of that. You'll see the quizzes show up. There's due dates for the quizzes. Those are done on Canvas here. So they're already open and ready to go. You complete them when you're ready. Those are the uh, Canvas quizzes. Uh, I think um, additionally here that you want to be pay attention to here is that you have the note sheets I have in, in by uh, chapters one through four together, five to eight, if that's easier to get. The formulas that we you're allowed to have on the exams. And then when we start using StatCrunch, which is our online software program, you will, um, um, here are some steps here. I also show how to do it in the videos too. So that's kind of the heart of the class and the work you're going to do. So I outlined within the modules, but note sheets, videos, and then do problems. And so that's what, uh, how you're going to kind of get through the material.